name is Jane Street and I'm the clinical lead in Wandsworth IAT and I'm also the Associate Director for Psychology and Psychotherapies in Wandsworth. I was delighted when the Wandsworth IAP team was chosen for an LIA journey because we had a number of projects we really wanted to achieve and we'd had difficulty moving forward. This included having additional clinical space and also a website to publicise all the work that we do. My name is Stephen Charlery, I'm the Lead Employment Specialist at the Wandsworth Psychological Therapies and Wellbeing Service, otherwise known as IAPT. Um, I was asked to be on the sponsor group for the LIA journey to discuss some of the challenges that we face in our team. And the challenges that we faced were the lack of a website, the lack of room space, and the lack of having a, well um, a CD community development worker within our team. Um, I found that having the LIA being part of the sponsor group, it was able to get some of our challenges addressed by senior management so that it raised the issues that we actually addressed. The part I'd like to focus on is about room space, which has become a big challenge, particularly now with a lot of GP surgeries now taking that space away from the department and being offered to other services which are receiving payment. And this affects um, patient care and our staff being able to see patients in the surgeries. So as a result of this LA journey, um, the challenges of room space has been brought to a head and now room space has been secured downstairs below in the old Jubilee Ward where we've now had to um, employ a lot of locum um, staff and we have a lot of space um, underneath which is used for therapy service. So that has been one part of the um, barriers that we faced being addressed by offering up additional room space for us to see patients on site. Hi, my name's Kate Busey and I'm a counselling psychologist. Um, I've got the, um, one of the reasons that I'm in LIA is because I have done a leadership role in another organisation and I want to bring some of the things that work from that organisation to Wandsworth. I'm, I'm aware that we need to develop new ways of working and so any input I can put into that is, is, is really what, what I want to do. Um, I also enjoy working as part of a, a wider organisation, which is what LIA is about, so seeing things from different perspectives. Um, and it's really nice that we've got all levels of, of the organisation in, in that room together, sort of thinking about kind of problems and their solutions from a variety of perspectives. One of the challenges that the service faces is obviously responding to you know fast-paced change, the same as many services in the current NHS culture. Um, and obviously this service is particularly mindful of, of having a, a, a clinically uh, safe service which adheres to trust and service values. Um, that's one of the challenges. I think the other challenge is around access and as we know, some services around us are, are reducing, so we're taking, um, we're reducing access barriers and bringing in, in, you know, possibly more complex patients coming into the service. So we're sort of managing a, a tension between access and gatekeeping. Um, in terms of successes, there's many successes that are happening and this is a result of, of being in LIA and having a lot of different levels of people thinking about, about the solutions. Um, for example, we've got lots of strategies to manage the waiting list now and lots of new staff. We've got an engagement officer to help um, with access. We've got um, we're sort of, you know, enhancing partnership working and for example I'm doing some work with the Carer Centre to sort of facilitate access and I'm working across two bases of the Carer Centre so we can get more carers coming into our service and reducing barriers to access. And of course all this means for patients, what this means for patients is shorter waiting lists, increased access and you know hopefully we're going to get good recovery rates because our staff are obviously very well trained and um, you know, we're going to have a focus on recovery as well. What's been really important as part of our LIA journey has been involving a lot more members of the team in decision making 
and making changes within the team. We're really delighted to know that by the end of this month we will have a website up and running and we also have plans to do a leaflet drop to every single household in Wandsworth so that everybody knows that the service is here and how easy it is to refer themselves to the team. In fact, one of the best things for me has been that I've been able to step back from doing so much and the other members of the team have stepped forward and taken the projects forward.